Braille is composed of six dots in a three by two matrix, and each of the dots have an, has a number that is assigned to it. And the Perkins is laid out just like the Braille cell. So underneath each of the keys is a small magnet, and then in the device that we have down here are Hall effect sensors. And once the magnet gets close enough, it sets off a trigger, and it sends that information to the server. I really love this project, and I'm so proud of all of the work that our team has done, especially when the students come to Purdue or we go to the school, and their faces just light up when we like, demonstrate the project, and we're able to read on the screen what they're typing. And just their reactions really make all of our hard work worthwhile. And the ability to have a device to help you translate between your code and the sighted person sitting in front of you and what they need to see. That's going to be huge for our kids. Um, it's really nice because, in, I mean, we're advancing in the world, so I'm just like, sighted people get new technology all the time, and it's um, really nice to know that blind people get technology too.